Hey everybody, thought I'd just jump on and play some more. I'm on Turbo, hanging out at the Centaur Huts, and I think we'll go check up and see if the Avis sets up with the bracelet. I don't know why, I always like killing that thing. Let's set ourselves on a 50 minute timer, and we'll see if we can find a mob up there. Just trudging our way up the hill. I don't believe, oh yeah, the lighting works on this client. So I have several clients installed on my desktop. And this is one particular client that does have the lighting issue solved. So I'll play on this one. I don't have Duxa on this one, do I? No, it doesn't have the experience percentage on my bar. But there we go, it's an Ava set. So I'll fight the Ava set. It's not Nari, but we don't have to kill Nari every time. So they are threatening to me, because I am an ogre. And there's no faction to worry about with these guys. Like you can never improve that faction. Interesting, there's a, a Treant, who's also threatening to me. Killing that will hurt my faction with druids. Make the font bigger, easier to see. I do like having those sound effects. Not too worried about much. I remember hanging out here back in the days. Just right here, and this is along the pathing area that Quillmane traverses. So sometimes you can see Quillmane. And then when I did see Quillmane, I would call out Quillmane here for whoever was trying to trigger the spawn. If you're really sneaky and evil, you can just kill the spawn yourself and take the, take the feather cloak if he dropped it. What do you think? Big tree ant? So I have turtle skin. Now these things are casters, so that makes them extra dangerous. Let's see what we need. I'm actually pretty far into level 32 already. I didn't realize. So it's becoming daylight now. Let's kill him. I don't think I'll lose too much faction with the druids for, for doing so. Let's just do it for funsies. And he's got Spirit of Wolf or something because I am barely catching up to him. All right, there he is. He's buffing himself up. The only thing we should watch out for is Avaset sneaking up upon us. Here we go, slow down, dude. You've got business to address. All right, now if, oh, I've got thorn, he's got thorns. If I run into trouble, there's no escape for me. There's no feign death. There's also no way I can outrun this guy. So my life is dropping quickly, but so is his. Now he's trying to heal himself up, but I don't think he's going to be able to manage. I've got too much DPS. When something's got thorned, it's probably best to use a slow swinging two-hander. All right, so our faction with the Jagged Pine Tree Folk got worse. Guards of Kinos got worse. Protectors of the Pine got worse. And Q. RG protected animals. I don't. Whoa! 91 gold! Guys, I just got 91 gold off that thing. And with all the silver, I mean, we're looking at 10 platinum. Just off the coin drops. Is that normal? Well, I guess so. There's a harrier. So I'm also going to attack the Harrier along the way. Let's see where we're at with experience. It looks like we are close to four yellow bars. Close, but not quite. That means we can get to level 33 in this episode, and then I'll go further. I'm going to go further into Split Paw, assuming no one's in there already fighting. So I'll kill this guy, and I'll make my way there. 
There's a Centaur Charger. He's blue. So this is a decent place to level as well in the open zone, especially if you're a ranger and you're able to track. You can track mobs that consider yellow, blue, whatever you need. All right, let's take a look at the experience bar, how it moves. I have to say it didn't move a whole lot, but there was movement. Now there is an Ava set, so I'm also going to fight the Ava set. I like these things. I love fighting in the outdoor zones. We'll use ranged, hopefully we gain some skill. Negative. Okay, so today I was supposed to give a presentation. Today is my day off, and we had a reach search symposium. I was supposed to go to it, give a presentation, and uh, I was there for about two hours, and they said, hey, you don't need to be here. You're supposed to be off. And I said, yeah, I know I'm supposed to be off. I emailed you guys about two weeks ago asking, do I need to be here because it is my day off. I have no problem showing up because I wanted to get credit for being there. It's part of our graduation requirements. Um, but they gave me no reply. I mean, I participated. I just didn't present. So about two hours into it, they came up to me like, hey, you don't need to be here. And I zoomed out the door. Lost a little bit of my free day and I didn't get a chance to sleep in. I do work tomorrow. It's just nice not to set your alarm clock. Unplug yourself from work for at least a 24 hour period. That's not gonna happen because I have to work tomorrow and I wanna get familiarized with my patients because we're doing inpatient, which means a lot of the patients already on the list, they've been there for days and days and days getting treatment in the more acute setting, so. I'll be picking up about half of the patient list. My friend will pick up the other half and we'll be managing them as interns. And by the way, I'm an intern for only four more weeks and then I'm a year two, I'm a PGY two, which means I get a increase in pay, a couple thousand dollars, which isn't really a big deal. But it also means I don't have to do intern stuff and the schedule gets nicer, so I'm gonna have more weekends off. And in fact, I need to talk to uh, Tofu because in four weeks from now, I'll finish hospital medicine and then I'll have a whole week off of work. So I'll have a vacation time I set myself. And that's when I'm gonna start a new project. The project's gonna be Project Crush Bone. I'm gonna play as a halfling and we're going to be rogue and the goal of the mission the goal of the series i should say is going to be beginning from scratch we're going to be getting a lot of heirlooms like bilbo got from frodo he got the mithril coat he also picked up sting from the barrow downs the blue the sword that was elfin made and then it, it uh, glows blue when goblins are nearby or goblins or orcs you can say the same thing. Um, so we're going to be taking some heirlooms with us is what I'm trying to say. Passed down from the generation of halflings of the Shire, Hobbiton. So the Shire is like the county, Hobbiton is the town or the village. And we are going to be setting forth from that location, which is also known as Misty Thicket, making our way to Greater Fay. And then I'm going to be at the earliest level possible entering Crushbone, either solo or in a group. It depends on what's around. If there's a group available, I will pick a group and I'll be a burglar, by the way. So I'm going to be picking pockets, I'm going to be backstabbing, I'm going to be sneaking around like a proper hobbit burglar. And we'll be playing with some dwarves probably, so it'll be like the hobbit story. And the goal is to completely 
finish Crush Bone, and that involves killing Emperor Crush himself in the throne room. So Emperor Crush is a orc chieftain, I would say, and he's in charge of Crush Bone. I'll try to do all the quests available and talk about the quests in length, all the details of how to do them and we will do them in the videos. It'll be fun. So that's a project that's on the horizon. In the meantime, I'm trying to figure out a good name for my character, because that's very important to have a good name. And so when I come up with the name, I'll let you guys know. And it's in the planning stages. And it should be a lot of fun. Okay, so everything is dying pretty easily. That is only worth about two or three gold. So I'm not going to loot it. Here we go, another blue. Okay, I'm almost up to four yellow bars. Which means I am 80% of the way through the level after I finish this kill. That's approximately 80%, or about four-fifths of a level. After I record this video, I'll upload it, answer some questions on my previous videos, lay in bed, play on my phone app game. Sometimes I go back and watch my own videos. I just go see how they turned out. And um, I usually fall asleep while I'm watching them. <laughs> it puts me to sleep. All right, I love having the sound. The lighting works great, so the only thing I don't have is Duxa, but we're almost back to square one, setting up EverQuest the way I like it with all the comforts and conveniences of a good UI system. Oh, fine still. All right, we're under attack. It's nice when they just come right to you and you don't have to chase them down. Okay, so now we are about 80% to this level. My hit points at 32, level 32, is 1584. That's a lot. AC's 845. It's nice that I don't lose AC for looting a lot of things. But we loot a lot. Let's just get our bags. We don't need this. A split paw. Just delete it this up here so it's there we go what is this slot a charm slot I don't know what goes in a charm slot troll is that a player out there yeah there's a player out there I'll leave that for him there's a play nice policy we try to play nice share spawns is there any player out here though I'll make sure I'm not taking anybody's spawn. There's a dead null here. I'll take one, but no more. Oh, there's a player there in the entrance. They're probably meditating. That is a safer spot to meditate, I think. There we go. All right, and we can do... Let's make some bandages, guys. Okay, so now I'm going to start making bandages so I can work on my bind wound.
Yeah, see this is an embalmer's knife. I gotta make sure I don't accidentally sell this because it looks like a fine steel dagger. So piercing is going up now, it's at 51. There we go, we just procced some bandages. So now I have 16 bandages. All we need is about one more proc. DPS has dropped a lot because I'm using this weapon. But hey, it's nice not having to go back to buy bandages. Some guy named Inken Finkenstein, Inken Finkens met, said that he needs a duo. Well, we could. He's a 32 Paladin. That would be a good duo for me and him. Uh oh. Okay, I thought it was gonna be. She, yep, she is attacking me. She's green to me though. She says time to die. So let's hurry up and finish this fight because I don't want to mess with that. Hell turbo, hell inconvenience. It's very interesting. He's a uh, Eirden Paladin. I mean, yeah, Eirden Paladin, which is a cool combo. Very low strength, high intelligence. Come on, give me some bandages. You feel dispelled? There we go. That's enough bandages, whatever. Let's finish this fight quick. I'm getting nuked at the moment. Getting nuked. There we go, we got him. Lady, why are you doing this? We had an understanding. Hopefully, hopefully she'll leave him alone. Whoa, it's all shaky. Yeah, I'll go inside. So let's uh, do it with Anka Munkenstein. Anka Finkensmet. Smet. Wonder if he wants to do. Uh, he went invisible. Oh, okay. Give myself um, turtle skin once more. Oh, there's a couple of us here. This guy too. Okay. Well, we got a full group now. Well, three of us. Uh, I don't even set up a pool macker, did I? Let's set one up. Pool. And we're going to make it bright red and we're going to say to the group pooling A percent T space exclamation point. fighting in the hallway I can barely see what's going on. He said back up. Oh I guess he rooted it. Yeah he rooted it. It's 
turn its back to the pally. So he's doing 29 points of damage. Easy. All right, so let's put in our other weapon, the one I like the most, which is this one. It looks like a belt. There we go. I thought he had already lulled it. Okay, did he lull it? Whatever. Hey, no biggie. Man, I was going to come in here and solo the whole place. <laughs> if he wants to pull, I'll definitely let him pull. I hate pulling. But of all of us, I'm by far the best equipped to pull. There's no way anybody's tankier than Turbo. So, um... We'll make this video a little longer than I planned because we're in a group now. All right, so we are gonna try to, I can't figure out which one he wants to get. Okay, he's gonna do this one. All right, you moving around and I'm moving around too. change targets. I'll let him figure out what he wants to do now since he's doing his own thing. Let's see where we are with experience. What happened? Too easy, guys. Too easy. We don't have to play fancy. We don't need finesse. You don't have to heal me. I've got a fungi tunic on, bro. Scooter Wiz says <laughs> this is my man and I'm broke. All right, let's turn. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's turn it on. Auto split. That's the first time we've had a request to turn on auto split. All right, let's go back. We'll take aggro from him, watch. There we go. I can lull and root. Yeah, I know. So you can do that. I like to pull one at a time. That's fine with me. I'm just, uh... There you go, Scooter Wiz, you loot. So since he wants to be the puller and he, um... Wants to do the lulls and the roots, we'll just do assist. I can't even type his name into assisted, it's just too long. Like, how the hell can I type assist?
All right, let's just try it out. I have to figure out how to assist. SEO is the name and it's gonna call it assist A N K E A N K H E F E N S E K H M E T. Hopefully I spelled it right. Sure. All right. Where is it? I can't see it. For some reason I turn auto attack off. It's nice to be a wizard in a group. You can just sit and med and wait. Something happens and then you can Blast it with your spells. That's what a wizard should be doing all the time. Scootawiz Bang, and then Ink. I'm not even trying to say his name anymore. All right, so I just like to watch what's going on. I hate sitting here as a monstrous tank. I guess he's worried about me getting a lot of pulls. I think he'll soon recognize that. My life is never going down. So he's drawing aggro by lulling and rooting or whatever he's doing. Did we kill it? Yeah, we killed it. Okay, we split. Wait, two platinum is part of my split. How? Is there some kind of like loot modifier? Active. Yeah, you loot that thing. <laughs> Took aggro from him. Just with my bow. Scooter Wiz has a macro that every time he does a spell, he says, um, it says some text, and so that's pretty cool. I guess we should get him locked down. I mean, here's the point where you might need to do some lulls. All right, it does work, so my assist macro works. So right now he's lulling. Evacuation, so I don't think we'll need it. Field of Bone. Hmm. There we go, guys. We gotta be close. Yes, we're close. We're less than half yellow bar. It's better than dying. Okay, if you say now, get close, we won't go to deep. He can pull whatever he wants. I'm 100% life. Uh, should we try the two-hander? How about we try something different? Let's just put on the Worm Slayer. And then we'll put on a Parrying Dagger. Now nah, we'll keep the one we got now. Yeah. I see the Wizard should loot a couple fine stills. I'm not gonna loot any. And since we don't need this, we'll put the statue up. Where's the statue go? Right there. Okay. Or should we use the Argent Protector? Let's do the Argent Protector. 
Yeah. All right, it won't fit in that bag. Big, bad two-hander. We need to up this skill before we level two. We need to max out all of our combat skills. So what do you guys think? A pretty chill group here? Looking at the graphics for every one of these items here. What do you guys say we chit on the other breastplate? There we go. We'll just hit the assist button. Trying to get aggro. There we go, we took aggro. And he takes so much damage. That's why I want to be the one pulling. <laughs> the wizard's got some funny text. Uh oh, look what's going on. Guys, stop it! Nuke it! Oh, he's reading it. <laughs> All right, so let's actually, yeah, we can keep using it, but let's let's take off the the burgundine thing. We're gonna put on the fungal tunic again. He can't tank nearly as well as me. There's just no way. Hmm. Let's give ourselves turtle skin. Just in case, let's get ready with our good stuff. Ah, come on, I'm not ready. Ah, I'm just trying to put my weapon on. Where's our weapon bag? Good grief, it's the last bag I check. I really can't see. So what I'm gonna do is open up this bag. Man, he's way too squishy. Dude, that's, needs to let me take aggro. So, uh, what was I gonna do? Yeah. Why is my turtle skin not landing? Oh, it probably won't overplace one of these others. Oh, I do have it active, no wonder. Let's give turtle skin to the scooter bags. Scooter Wiz. Let's give turtle skin to this guy. We'd be flying through these if I was tanking. <laughs> and he was just assisting me. I don't care if I got two or three on me. I don't need crowd control. 
Uh oh, you got competition, dude. Another wizard showed up. Oh yeah, I don't mind. I'm actually having fun. I can't take aggro because he's got so much aggro generated before we start the fight. By him uh, and his health because I can tank twice as well I think I'm just gonna go pull it. They're underestimating the turbo. Who cares about ads? Just don't pull the ads off me. Just assist me and let the ads all pummel me for, for a while. I'm fine, guys, I'm fine. even utilizing my fungi tunic. You too weak to tank, let me tank. If you just wait. Okay, they came in this room. That's fine with me, guys. I was pulling back, but you guys charged it.
He's just too cautious. So this thing is only blue to me, it's easy. Watch my life regenerate as I fight. I've got 61% of my life. 62. So the only thing is that dot that he put on me. Don't heal me anymore. Save it. Save your mana. All right, if he wants to pull it, I'll let him do now. Um, we're getting good loot on splits. Really good loot. Finally, let's get forward. Let's move up, move up, move up. There's one right here. Hello. So this one is still a blue con. And we're about to level up. We've got the nukes. We've got the heels. We've got the tanks and the regions. We've got it all. All right, we'll let him lull whatever he wants. He's got a nice weapon. The pet roots, that's fine. As soon as he's up with his mana, we are ready to do it. Let's see, wizard. You're gonna be the little nuke guy. KK, just run if needed and I will evac. Okay. Can't figure out which one he's fighting. I'm trying to get the, the pet. Good, I got the pet on me. Now I'm gonna assist him. I was trying to get the aggro. I'm rooted. Okay, we're fine. Okay, so... I'm going to try to get the aggro of this guy. Now I'm going to assist him. So I'm trying to get aggro off of them and on me. He can probably, he's going to try to evacuate us, but we'll be fine if they stay. We're almost there, guys. Almost there. Okay, I'm going to assist him. I can't see. Where is it? It's on top of me. I can't even look. The damn knoll's on top of me, and I'm, I'm uh, rooted, so I can't change my views. <laughs> I'm rooted. There we go. I'm rooted again. Stop rooting me. We got it. So that was fun, actually. I enjoy these kind of fights. This is what I love about EQ. I love 
fights that are like this. I hate easy, simple pulls where we're just sitting there pulling one after the other and they just die so easily. I like these challenging pulls. So, I mean, that was close call maybe, but that's what I like it. Okay, there we go. Good XP, fun, fun, fun. <laughs> no, it wasn't messy. That was the way it's supposed to be. Don't heal me. Good. <laughs> All of us barely surviving. I come in here and I try to solo this crap and I escape with like 3% life that's just the way I play look at my life regenerating Regenerating. Guys, get the loot. That's great. Scooter Wiz got a fine, still great staff. There's your money. Let's get through here. <laughs> that was a fun adventure. Hope I wasn't too complaining about the, the pacing, but I was trying to do a lot in this video. So here, let me pull it. I don't care if both of them come. Guys, don't pull them off me. Got it. Hey, he's trying to crowd control. Don't worry, man, just assist. We've got these. DPS them down. My life regenerates in between fights. Let's go crazy. Non-stop. Sweet, my skills are increasing too. Awesome. Oh yeah, also I've got that control A thing. I should have used my uh, discipline. Oh my god, he nearly died so fast. <laughs> he took aggro and his life just plummets. Let's see if we can bandage him. My bind wound is terrible. Dude, don't worry about it. It's all good. I don't even think we're going to have any kind of bind wound skill. Let's see what we have. 21%, 10 to 24, it's not bad. Yeah, there we go. Wow, this video is getting long, but at least we dinged. Okay guys, level 33, huge. Oh, we got him above 51% life now. Oh, 
Oh, there's our timer off. I'll let him pull it. So yeah, he's facing the back side so he doesn't have to worry about um, repose. Some of the defensive skills only works on the front side. All right. Come on, little wizard. I brought a little chaos to the group. I think you got a dagger of dropping. I'll camp right here. Oh yeah, he did get it. They can handle those two on the entrance. I'm sure they can. He'll just have to use his root, his soothe, and all that stuff. Thanks for watching, guys. That was the end of this episode. I'm going to go lay down in bed and play on my phone. <laughs>